going to show you how to make this flower coaster and it looks like a poinsettia flower. I used a G hook. You can use any type of hook but with that hook size um, it was five inches um, around like across and the dimensions are five inches. Um, you, of course you can make it bigger or smaller depending. I use medium worsted um, Karen Soft yarn red yarn as well medium worsted okay so um, let's get started and I'll show you step by step on how to make this pretty flower coaster you're going to start with a slip knot onto your hook with a chain four slip stitch to create a ring chain one, single crochet eight inside the ring, and then slip stitch in that beginning to end it. So that's one, and then two, three, four, continue until you have eight. slip stitch in that beginning single crochet to complete this round. It's going to look like this. You're going to chain two, work three double crochet together in the same stitch. So you're going to yarn over, pull through two, leave two loops on the hook, yarn over, insert your hook, grab the yarn, yarn over, pull through two loops, leave three loops on the hook, one more double crochet inside the same stitch, grab the yarn, yarn over, pull through two loops, and then yarn over and pull through all four loops on the hook to complete three double crochet together. Then you're going to chain three, and then in the next stitch you're going to work four double crochet together, insert your hook, grab the yarn, yarn over, pull through two loops, leave two loops on the hook, yarn over, insert your hook, grab the yarn, yarn over, pull through two loops, leave three loops on the hook, yarn over, insert your hook, grab the yarn, yarn over, pull through two loops, leave four loops on the hook, yarn over, insert your hook, grab the yarn, yarn over, pull through two loops, and then pull through all five loops to complete four double crochet together. And then you're going to chain three again and you're going to repeat this. Four double crochet together the same exact way for each stitch around. You're going to repeat the last one in the last stitch, four double crochet together, and that will be a total of eight all together. Chain three and slip stitch in the center of that three double crochet together, and then chain one and fasten off and you have your eight petals all together and then you're going to slip knot onto your hook and slip stitch in between any chain three and then you're going to chain one and then work four double crochet together in the chain three. So this is four double crochet together 
just like before. Then you're going to chain four and then work four double crochet together in the same chain three space. chain four and then in the next chain three space you're going to work four double crochet together and then a chain four again and then four double crochet together in the same chain three space repeat that around and the pattern is listed down below Okay, it's going to look like this and you're going to repeat this um, in each chain three space until the beginning. Okay, now chain four at the end here. Substitch in the center of the four double crochet together. And then you're going to fasten off and weave in all your ends to finish this pattern. Weave in your ends about three to four times in the back to secure your ends and hide them. Once you finish that, then this pattern is complete. So thank you for watching and make sure to subscribe.